This video will demonstrate how to perform a spatial query using ArcGIS Pro. The data being used for this demonstration are uh, counties, major cities, and major highways in Washington State. Spatial queries allow us to select features based on a spatial relationship. In a spatial query, a spatial operator is used to test a relationship between two layers, and those features that meet the specified criteria are then selected. To perform a spatial query in ArcGIS Pro, we click on Select by Location in the selection group of the map ribbon. We see that Select Layer by Location opens up in the geoprocessing pane. For uh, the, the first demonstration I'll do here, let's say that I want to select those counties that have a major highway running through them. So for the input feature class, I want to make sure that uh, the Washington counties layer is selected. It's already in there. Otherwise, we can select the appropriate layer from uh, the drop-down menu here. And then if we move down, we see that we've got this relationship field. And if we click on the drop-down menu, we see a number of options are available. Some of these spatial operators that are listed here pertain to spatial relationships of distance or proximity, such as within a distance. Some of these spatial operators pertain to spatial relationships of intersection, such as intersect or boundary touches. Other spatial operators pertain to spatial relationships of containment. So uh, instances of this would be contains or within. So depending on the type of data being used, not all of these spatial operators are going to be available. For example, a point from point data cannot contain a polygon. So uh, for this demonstration where I'm looking at counties that have a major highway running through them, I am going to uh, select intersect and then for selecting features this is where I will choose major highways and then I can go ahead and click run. We can see that the spatial query uh, has been successfully run. We see those counties that met the criteria specified through this select by location are outlined in blue. We can create a layer from these selected features so that we can isolate or separate those selected features from the original data set. And what we would do is right click on the Washington counties layer, we go to selection, and then make layer from selected features. We can see that that uh, new layer from those selected features is now added to the contents pane. And I'll go ahead and clear the selection here. If I turn off the original Was Washington counties layer, we can see that from the Washington counties selection layer, only those counties that are intersected or have a, a high, major highway running through them are available here. Now I'll show a second example of a spatial query and let's say that we're interested in selecting those cities that fall within two miles of a major highway. So we're looking at proximity here as the spatial relationship between highways and cities. So I will just turn back on the Washington counties layer. I'm going to click the back button here and uh, just reopen select layer by location. I can do that. It's listed here in recent or I can go back and click the button from the, the map ribbon. So I am going to uh, do my input features. I'm going to set them as uh, cities, so Washington cities. The relationship here, though, again, is going to be, I'm looking at proximity. 
So I'm going to choose within a distance. And selecting features, I will set as major highways. And here's where we would specify a search distance. So I'm say I'm interested in two miles, so I'll enter a two in that field. And then for units, I will click the drop down and select miles. And I will go ahead and click run. And we can see on the map that those cities that fall within two miles of a major highway are highlighted in blue. We can see that um, most readily in the uh, Seattle area. So once again, we can right click on the cities layer, go to selection and make layer from selected features. You can clear out the selection now. And if I uh, turn off the Washington, the original Washington cities layer, we can see that what it remains are those cities that were selected here that fall within two miles of a major highway.